It's lit. lit. Just take a look at the drip. drip. You boys don't get flyer than this. Nest. Roll a dope, yeah, I'm high as a bitch. bitch. Wait, it's lit. lit. Get that little bitch a little tip. tip. Now she wanna suck on the dick. dick. She wanna catch all of the drip. 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 Pull up in the Hey guys, it's Bella. Welcome back to my YouTube channel. Today we're gonna be talking about some fashion trends that I've fallen in love with, some celebrity gossip, and some fitness tips. The first trend that I've seen everywhere recently is moon boots. Moon boots have actually been around since 1969 and they started in Soho. So let's find out some more. So I've actually seen these all over my Pinterest feed, my TikTok feed, and mostly on my Instagram feed when all these like cute little girls do their, you know, going on my winter excursion and here's some cute outfit ideas for the winter. So that's kind of where I got my inspiration. Um, so this is a moon boot. Um, it definitely looks like a space boot, and I get why it's called moon boot. Um, but they're super cute. They have different styles. They have fur. I wanted the fur, but they were literally sold out everywhere. Like, they are so popular, and they're sold out everywhere. I was so lucky to get these. Like, this was like a one in a million. So let's try them on. So these boots range from around $125 to up to, I think it's like $350 right now. Um, so you can get a bunch of different styles. They have high ones, they have low cut, they have medium cut, they have slippers, they have it all. So these boots are very, like, on the outside, they definitely feel like they're very winter tech. Um, the bottom has little grippies, so when you're walking in the snow, you don't feel it. The bottom is very secure. The inside is kind of like a foam material. I don't know if you can see that on camera, but it's very much like a foam material. They're very padded, very, very warm, and very comfortable. Um, it's kind of almost like, I don't mean to compare it to this, but like if you've ever broken your foot, that's kind of what it's giving. But they're super cute. Okay guys, so I'm gonna try to recreate the cute little photos that I see all over my Instagram of the girls at the ski slope. So I have two hats that match my outfits here. I have this hat, which is really cute actually. And I have this hat. And I have a vest, so let's try them on. Okay, so I'm gonna try this hat on. It's giving, it's giving a look. Okay, now I'm gonna put the, I can't hear anything in this hat, believe it or not. It covers my ears and it's very heavy. So, I'm gonna try this vest on with it. So I'm really actually loving this outfit. It's very much giving like a lot, like it's serving like I'm going to be at a ski slope, but I'm not gonna ski. I'm just gonna stand there and I'm gonna look effing pretty. Um, so let's recreate some pictures now. NightOwlHipHop.com Yeah. Holy smokes, I'm no joke out the bullpen. Bringing nothing but heat, leave you hanging like clothespins. He's a beast when he goes in. Ice cold frozen. The first round. Okay, guys, I'm gonna switch this look up. I'm gonna change it to black. So let's go. Okay guys, so here is the black version. This bodysuit is from Amazon. I ordered it for my Halloween costume, but I fell in love with it. Um, these are actually from, where are these from? Uh, Wong. These are from Wong and Trading. It is like a wholesale company. Um, and then I have, this is, this is the other version of the white hat. This is leather um, with the little side thingies. This is from the same company, Canada Goose. So I'm gonna go ahead and put it on. You can even add a cute little bomber jacket to make it an everyday look. Okay guys, so my biggest fashion tip of this week is that you don't have to spend a lot of money on your outfits to look cute. Like a bodysuit, I definitely recommend you get these because you can dress them up in so many different ways. You can get them in white, black, brown, and dress them up with a vest, a coat, and also, I found that when you spend a lot of money, well, not even spend a lot of money, if you splurge on one item of your outfit, it just does it. Like, these boots were $185, and that's the most expensive thing I have on. This bodysuit, I think it was like $25 bucks from Amazon, and these were like $14. Bucks. So, you know what? You don't have to splurge to look adorable. Broke bitch tips. Hey guys, welcome to this week's episode of Celebrity Gossip. Let's get right into it. So the Miss Universe pageant is going to be on January 14th, which is only four days away. 
That's crazy. So I'm so excited to see all of the different fashions. It is taking place in New Orleans, Louisiana. I am stoked. Coming from a pageant girl, I know exactly how they're feeling. It's it's pageant weekend. They're all saying, oh, I'm going to go and be kumbaya. No, you're going to win, girl. It is Miss Universe. You want to win Miss Universe. So I'm going to be putting a poll up on my Instagram. Costume competition is coming up. So I'll be doing a poll on who had the best costume. We're going to do like a little pageant fan off. So stay tuned. Mm. Here are a few of my top picks that we should definitely watch out for this weekend. Definitely Dominican Republic. She's stunning and she has a very great speech. Um, France, she she just has a very unique look. I love her headshot. Um, Greece, just look at that. Like she's just beautiful. Um, Iceland, I actually saw she was actually um at the Miss Teen USA pageant. So I got to see her and she's gorgeous. So definitely her. And Panama, guys, this is the best headshot I've seen ever for a pageant headshot. That's freaking bomb. Um, and, of course, USA, Miss Texas. Um, I saw her win. She's gorgeous. And good luck to you, girl. Next thing I want to talk about on our celebrity news is going to be the Super Bowl. Super Bowl is February 12th, and our girl Rihanna is gearing up for her performance by coming out with some Super Bowl-themed Savage X Fenty merch. So, guys, let me tell you something. I went to California for, New I mean, I went to Vegas for New Year's, guys, and I went to the Savage X Fenty store for the first time, and when I tell you I blew a bag, I blew a bag in there. I never believed the hype, and now I do. I got some really cute underwear. I got this really cute little crop top. I got some booty shorts. Guys, it's crazy. So I'm excited to see what she has in store for this Super Bowl merch. And now let's check in with our Canadian correspondent, Nicole. I am super excited to hear that Rihanna took the stage for the Super Bowl game next month. Not only will she be singing, but she also got some real cool merch. Rihanna first entered the pop music scene in 2007, the year that I was born. Crazy. This is the year that she released her first ever album called Music of the Sun. Super majestic. Rihanna has since taken over the industry. I'm literally so in love with her music. I wonder what she's wearing to the Super Bowl game. Guys, I know everybody has been looking for Kanye all over and nobody could seem to find him. But he is found, and of course, with a chick on his arm. Of course, a blonde, you know. It was me. Just kidding. It's like, it's not. But he was spotted in his car laughing with a beach blonde chick. So he is found. He is no longer missing. So, typical ye. Oh my god, I cannot believe that he's been finally found. I mean, the internet is kind of getting boring without him. And he ha now has a new mystery girl, which I cannot wait to find out about. Anyways, speaking of Kanye, his daughter North just posted a TikTok showing off her child-friendly village called The Hidden Hills. And in her TikTok, she was showing off multiple different stores, such as Starbucks, a flower store, a grocery store, and a diner called The West Diner. She is literally living my childhood dream. And I definitely think that she is running TikTok right now. I mean, go north. So we have a new singer slash rapper hitting the market. His name is Connor Pierce. He's off the market. He's married and has a kid named Jude. So he's off the market. Um, but his music has been blowing up. It's all over TikTok. Let me play it for you so you guys can hear it. I already know you guys have heard it because everyone's using it in their reels. They said that I couldn't do it, so I wouldn't copyright sorry let me stop um but his music is blowing up so definitely keep an eye out for him and go check out his music and use his reels because they are blowing up. okay guys that is it for this week's segment of bella's on air vlogs thank you for tuning in i hope you enjoyed comment down below what kind of segments you want to see next stay tuned on my instagram because i'm doing some fun polls and um i hope you listen to my advice because i mean it bye yeah. Let's get it. It's lit. Just take a look at the drip. 
You boys don't get flyer than this Roll a dope, yeah, I'm high as a bitch Wait, it's lit Get that little bitch a little tip Now she wanna suck on the dick She wanna catch all of the drip, drip, drip Pull up and I'm loading the clip New bitch, yeah, stay on my hip